Right, good morning, welcome back. Now today, Yamaha, Blue Spot, four piston calipers, full rebuild. Now over 14 years and 1600 videos, at least 100 or more of them have been related in some way or another to restoring brakes. So rather than make this yet another detailed tutorial, I'll run the job through on time-lapse just to make it entertaining and I'll maybe cover the pertinent points here and there on the way through. And as to the controversy over these blue spot caps, I will address that at the end. In the meantime, I've got lots to do, so let's get busy. And when I rode this bike home from buying it, apart from the back end, wagging its tail like a puppy dog due to the swing arm bearings being completely shot. Also, the front brakes were binding quite badly as well. When you lift the front up, spun the wheel, you got maybe a quarter of a turn and it stopped. And that's pretty dangerous as we all know. And you can see from looking at the calipers exactly why they were binding. These are way beyond just replacing the pads and a little cleanup. These need a full rebuild, which now we've got them off, we can do. So...
Right, in the previous video we did showing the rear blue spot caliper being refurbished, I showed you the technique on how to get a stuck piston out using an extension bar and a socket and rotate them against each other. And I made mention in that video that there is a special tool for the job and if you don't have one, this trick works. Well, somebody heard that and said, look, would you like the special tool? And they went and sent us one. So that's very kind. Thank you so much for that. You know who you are. And now we get to demonstrate how it's done with the proper tool as well as the trick with the extension bar and the socket. Let's go.
Well, that's it, all done. Now, I'll flood the system up with fluid at the end once I see what money I've got left in the budget after all of the major works are done to see if I can afford braided hoses. If I can, then I'll get some and I'll flood all the hydraulics up at once. If not, then I'll have to use these. Anyway, let's now deal with this controversy, this drama over these blue spot caps. So yes, the advice on these blue spot caps from Yamaha is clear. You do not need to remove them from the calipers for normal servicing. But when your calipers look like this after years of neglect and it takes this kind of malarkey to rip them apart then you're a long way from normal servicing aren't you you're then firmly into the world of restoration and there's no advice in any service manual on the procedures of restoration and restoration of parts often requires going beyond what's normal and advised sometimes completely contradicting it in order to achieve what's necessary anyway i'll leave that there Thank you for watching, and I'll see you next time. Now, as to the controversy, and the, is it controversy or controversy? It doesn't matter. Doesn't matter. Controversy, controversy. As to the difference of opinion on these blue spot caliper. <laughs>